Matrix Talk. Hi, this is Dr. Robinson, and today we are doing NVDA and UEB math. Uh, just so you know, this works flawlessly with JAWS and UEB math also. Look for those videos, and you will quickly learn how to change that into UEB math from Nemeth. Uh, I'm a big proponent of learn everything. Um, but anyway, today you're going to be doing a little bit of a Nem uh, LaTeX. Uh, with UEB math. You can browse this in on a browser display if you have a browser display, uh, or you can do it off of a keyboard and of course have the Braille um, to you also for those who want Braille. Uh, really, every option is available now between NVDA and JAWS. It is uh, just really an exciting time to be alive for math. Okay, let's go ahead and down arrow and let me show you how you're gonna use UEB math with this. Down arrow. Blank, A is equal to the two by two matrix, row one, two, four, row two, one, two, section one. Yep, really go gorgeous. So it's spatially set up perfectly. That's how you would actually hand it in to your teacher. But uh, let's say we actually did this work and there was a mistake in it, um, or you discovered the mistake when you went back to review it before you actually handed it in. And changing the math uh, when it's in spatial mode is incredibly challenging next to almost impossible but you don't have to. Uh, so this is in LaTeX. I'm gonna show you the LaTeX in order to do a matrices with NVDA. And it's uh, very similar with Nemeth, of course, if you're going to braille it in, you have a braille display, it is going to be different. And once again, all those who are visual can see the beautiful braille up in the top right-hand corner in the braille viewer. Okay, so let me show you how you're going to get this set up in LaTeX and then how to write it out, uh, and then of course change what you need to change. I need a left arrow, so whenever you're looking for the equation editor, and if you're a screen reader user, I always tell people just hit home, home. A is equal to the two by two matrix, row one, two, four, row two, one, two, cap A. And you heard the beep. If I up arrow, you go out of it, and down arrow. If you can right arrow, so right arrow. Equals. Equals. Okay, so um, you can you can write arrow through it. You know you're in your equation editor. Once again, I don't suggest editing in here. That is uh, very challenging. I'm going to show you how to go to LaTeX first, and then I'm going to show you how to convert it into linear mode. I also call it inline because I, I think of it as inline. I can go left and right very easily to change what I need to change. So uh, you can understand my terminology. I'm going to do Alt-J and then E to go to the equation editor. Uh, if I was to create this, it would be all equals. I highly suggest all transcribers learn how to do this so they can transcribe the work for the student, even though we do have AI now who can do a lot of that translating. Uh, but even with AI, even if there's one error, that's a problem with math, <laughs> as anyone knows. Here we go, Alt-J and then E. Ribbon tabs tab E, equation tools grouping. I'm just going to hush him up because he's just going to tell me I'm in 16 of 16 and a whole bunch of other stuff I don't need to listen to. I'm going to hit TX. It's already selected. That is the LaTeX. So TX. TX. Document A is equal to the two. Pops me back into the document. And now I'm going to convert it from this beautiful professional spatial layout that that's the way you're going to hand in your work. That's the way everybody is, every sighted person's handed in their work from the start of the beginning of math. Okay, so let's go ahead and do it. Alt J E and you're going to hear C to convert. Ribbon tabs E. C. Current. Professional not checked. Mm -hmm. Convert the currently selected equation to display for current. Linear check. Convert the current. Linear. I'm going to tell you there is an all professional and an all linear under this menu also. And I highly suggest at the very end of all your math, you always go down to all professional because we're humans. We forget once again, and you may forget to change out of that linear mode, which is going to be your LaTeX. You can also do this in Unicode, um, but LaTeX is, well, they've all been around for a long time. Anyway, just change to all professional to make sure it all changes to all professional so you're ready to hand this in. I'm going to hit enter on linear. Document selected A equals left open paren begin open brace matrix close brace 2 and 4 1 and 2 and open brace matrix close brace right close paren. Okay, so it didn't read everything uh, like it should and never trust just that huge length of audio output. You really do need to right arrow through it. 
And I'm going to just show you how to change a number. And then, of course, I want to change it back because that is the map in here. Let's go ahead and write arrow. Page 1, Section 1. Carriage return. A yeah. equals left open paren begin open. And I'm going to hush up my control. So I hit my right arrow. I don't suggest doing that. Uh, you, If you hit your right arrow, you need to go ahead and hit your home. Always get very used to hitting your home so you know you're at the start of your problem. Home. A is equal to backslash left open paren. And I'm just going to hush them up because I want to go one character at a time. I'm going to right arrow through this. Equals backslash. Okay, so backslash. I'm just going to be quiet and you, let you guys listen. Oh, and if you don't know where the backslash is, it's the third key to the right of your P. Uh, depends on your computer that you get in the rest of the world because our students have it differently. And of course, I have to learn their keyboards when we're working with them. So this, these are U.S. keyboards. They're going to be third uh, key to the right of uh, P. So in your country, your computer, just figure out where that is and then you'll be good to go. L E F T. Okay, left, pretty easy. Open paren. Okay, open paren. So, uh, you know, once again, in, in America, uh, you're going to go ahead and do shift nine, which is going to be open. And of course, close is going to be share with your zero. You're going to do shift zero. Let's keep going. Backslash B E G I N. Okay, so whenever you have left or begin, just know that you're going to have to have an end and you're going to have to have a right on the other end of this. This is coding, whatever you begin, just know, and it, and this is makes it easy to memorize. You're gonna begin it, where are you starting, and what do you wanna put in here? Open brace. Okay, and we're opening the brace, what do you wanna create? We wanna create a matrix. M, A, T, R, I, X, close brace, two, and four. Okay, so let's say we actually don't want the four. I'm gonna show you how easy it is. I'm just gonna hit the delete key. A is equal to- I'm gonna put three. Three. That easy. So that is how easy it is to edit when you're in linear mode. I'm going to go ahead and put that back because, of course, that's not going to follow my math in this page. I'm going to hit backspace. Three. And put a four back. Four. Let's go ahead and continue. A is equal to back one. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't hear the backslash. 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 Okay. So backslash is basically delineating, well, what's at the top? What is at the bottom? Where are you going? So just keep that in mind. Backslash one and two. Okay, that makes it pretty clear. That's very easy to end four, and then you're on the bottom of it. It's gonna be one and two. And then to end that whole matrix, you always have to have three backslashes. Backslash, backslash, backslash. Okay, and then we need to end this. E, N, D. Okay, we're gonna end the matrix. Open brace, M, A, T, R. X, close brace. Okay, and then we're going to end it to the right. Backslash, R, I, G, H, T. Okay, so this is how, th these are just tricks that I use to memorize um, path names. You know, I kind of talk myself through it. It's like, okay, well, now what do I need to do? Oh, yeah, it's at the left. Now, how, how am I going to do this? Uh, so that's just a trick that I use. Uh, everybody has to come up with their own creative tools in order to memorize code or whatever they need to do. Um, but I highly suggest uh, just entering in a problem and, of course, change to linear, and you can very quickly learn the LaTeX or whatever code is involved. I'm going to change this to beautiful uh, visual professional again. Alt J E C. Here we go. Alt. Ribbon tabs tab control E. And then C. C. Current. Professional not checked. Convert the and current. Enter. Document selected cap A equals open paren 2 by 2 matrix 2, 4. Next row, one, two end matrix, close okay. paren, document. Lovely. Okay, let's go ahead and go down arrow, and now let's just listen to all the content. A is equal to backslash left. Once again, that's the uh, linear code that I have just sitting there so people can see it and they can see the Braille that's connected to that up in the Braille viewer if you're a visual. Blank. B is equal to the two by two matrix, row one, one, three, row two, one, two, section one and equation. Once again, if you want to learn that code, we're gonna do Alt J E C and down to linear. Ribbon tabs E, equation C, current, current, linear not checked convert, document selected B equals left open paren begin open brace matrix close brace. And I always just hush them because sometimes it works and sometimes it does not. So I'm going to hit right arrow. B is equal to 
backslash left. Now you heard that pop, which tells you you're at home. But if you don't want to just figure that out for sure, just hit home. Equation. Okay. Equation, right arrow. Equals backslash L E F T. Open paren backslash B E G I N. Open brace M A T R I X. Close brace one and three backslash backslash one and two backslash 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 e n d open brace m a t r i x close brace backslash r i g h t okay and that's what you have to do in order to oh i forgot one thing which is very crucial close paren oh yeah whatever you open you gotta close Okay, beautiful. I'm going to go ahead and change this back to professional. Alt, J, E, and then C. Ribbon tab, E. Equation tools grouping, C. Current, current, linear check convert the currently select, current, professional, professional. not, document selected cap B equals open. Okay, let's go ahead and continue with the math. And I am going to tell you when you get down to the point where you actually have to add these, and I would highly suggest whether it's in a, a Word document, uh, by right now, everybody should know, okay, if I, I already know the top, I need to have a two plus one in there and I need to have a four plus three, uh, write it down. So then when you get down to where you need to actually write out the answers, you're ready to go. Um, I'm going to also show you how to do this in Math Kicker AI, which makes it a lot faster. But if you get this document in Word, that's how you uh, need to know how to do it. You need to have scratch paper somehow, or a brailler, or a slate stylus, or whatever. Okay, down arrow. Page one, section one, find the matrix C such that C is equal to A plus B, cap okay. B equals O. So right there, C equals A plus B. Um, and your teacher, you're going to be in class, your teacher is going to show you how to do matrices, so you know what to do. But do have scratch paper there so you can actually write down your answers so you're ready to go to actually put it in a formula when you get down to that part. Blank. To find the matrix C such that C is equal to A plus B. And don't you love how that ends? So I explained this issue in JAWS also, and this is a Microsoft Word little hiccup. So I'm going to control right arrow because that did not read the whole line because to find the matri matrix C such that C equals A plus B and then no information, it's because words are actually following um, the word math editor and that gives it a huge hiccup. So if you're a transcriber, let me show you how you can do this. So I'm going to control right arrow. C such that C is equal to A plus B equation equal cap A plus cap B. We. We. So you're going to hit enter. We add the corresponding L. Now watch how it will read the whole thing. So once again, this is for transcribers to uh, transcribe this correctly. If you're a screen reader user and you don't feel the end of the, hear the end of the sentence, control right arrow, get there. Just know you need to get past the um, equation and then you'll actually hear the rest of the sentence. So I'm going to up arrow. To find the matrix C such that C is equal to A plus B. Now, down arrow. We add the corresponding elements of matrices A ampersand B. Okay. And once again, um, we've got a math consortium working with uh, <laughs> wonderful people at Microsoft, so this can be corrected also. Down arrow. Blank. The matrix C is obtained by adding each element of A to the corresponding element of B. Okay. Uh, hopefully, you'll know that very quickly. Blank. C is equal to A plus B is equal to the 2 by 2 matrix, row 1. Column 1, 2 plus 1, column 2, 4 plus 3, row 2, column 1, 1 plus 1, column 2, 2 plus 2, section 1. So what I'm going to tell you, if you really want to go over this in detail, we're going to go ahead and change to linear, alt, j, e, c. Ribbon tab, e, equation tool, c, current, linear not checked, document selected, c, e. And wouldn't that be cool if we had a command that could quickly switch us back and forth between linear and professional? I'm just putting that wish out there to the world. Okay, and then of course, visually, you can actually see the UEB math just beautiful up in the top right-hand corner. So if you're the teacher and you actually need to teach this, uh, all you have to do is just look at the code and then teach that code to your student. They can braille this out in a braille display very quickly if you're an auditory learner. Um, and you need both skills. 
Uh, but there's people who don't have broad displays, but you can uh, learn to change between professional and linear, and that will solve a lot of issues. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and hit a right arrow. C is equal to A plus B is equal to backs. I'm going to hush him up, and I'm just going to left arrow through this so you can listen. Equals A plus B equals backslash L E F T open paren backslash B E G I N open brace. M A T R I X close brace two plus one and okay remember that and uh, or ampersand that is dividing the two plus one uh, from the four plus three once again these are just little tricks that uh, I've come up with in my head uh, in order to memorize uh, all the code four plus three backslash okay so it's telling you you're done with that top row and now you're moving down to the bottom row backslash or the next row because you might have a three by three or a four by four matrix or whatever one plus one and okay so every time you hear that you're gonna okay next row is two plus two and then end the whole thing backslash 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 three backslashes e n d open brace m a t r i X close brace backslash R I G H T close paren. And so once again, whatever you open, you need to close and the code just follows each other beautifully. Okay, so anywhere in here, you can backspace or uh, delete and change very, very easily. But you, of course, you want to change it back to beautiful professional spatial uh, because a lot of people can't read code. And uh, you want to send this to a sighted person so they can read it easily. Alt J. E, C, and enter on professional. Ribbon tab, E, C, current, professional, document selected cap. Here we go, and down arrow. And of course, you want to do the math right there, but hopefully you did the math up when you were, you know, find the matrix C, such that C equals A plus B. Hopefully you've already done that math, so you're actually able to write that uh, mathematical problem out quickly, and then, of course, put your answers below. Page calculating each element to find results. Blank. C is equal to A plus B is equal to the 2 by 2 matrix. Okay. Row 1, 3, 7. Row 2, 2, 4. Section 1. Just, I'm going to hit home. C is equal to A plus B I'm is equal to... hush him up, uh, and, of course, I'm going to change it to uh, linear one more time. Alt, J, E, C. Ribbon tab, E, equation, C, current, current, linear now, notch, matrix dot docs, word. D okay, and our last time listening to the linear, and of course I'm going to the very, very end, I always do all professional to make sure all of it is done in professional and I didn't accidentally forget in linear, and I did that on purpose. So if you're visual, you actually see, hey, you've got a linear up at the very top. But this is how you correct all of that very quickly. I'm going to right arrow. C is equal to A. Okay. Listen closely. I'm going to right arrow through this so you can hear it. Equals A plus B equals backslash L E F T open paren backslash B E G I N open brace M A T R I X close brace three and seven backslash backslash and remember that tells you you're separating the lines now from the top and the bottom two and four end it all backslash 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 e n d open brace m a t r i x close brace backslash r i g h t close paren okay beautiful okay so at the very end we just want to make sure all this math is ready to hand in alt j e c and actually, it's going to be A for convert all. I'm going to down arrow instead of hitting the letter, just so you can hear everything. Alt J E. Ribbon tab E. C. Current. Current. Linear checked convert all. Professional not checked convert all equations okay. to display format. Want. Document selected cap C equal. Okay. And at that, it instantaneously changes the whole document back to professional. I'm ready to hand this in to uh, my teacher for grading. So that is UEB with NVDA. Once again, JAWS and NVDA are doing a really great job. JAWS is the one that does it uh, beautifully with Nemeth, uh, though. So keep that in mind. But if you're UEB math, you can do with either screen reader. Okay, hope that helps. And look for more videos that are coming up. And uh, great. It's always wonderful sharing. Matrices, with you. cap, zoom.
you have s- 